I'm going to tell you all my secrets. Okay, I'm going to go to Latte, and you should have full access to it. And uh, basically, if we refer here to my grading rules, you see that I have class participation 10. I'm going to change this a little bit. Non-programming assignments 20, team contribution 15, final deliverables that, programming assignments that. So there's one, two, three, four, five categories, right? And you see here three. But the funny thing is that there's, there's many levels to, uh, to uh, implementing a, a category because this is just the structure of the front page. If I go, the, 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 the metaphor in Latte is that there's always this editing menu over here. And if I go here and I, for example, say, not that you'll have to do it, but i just show you how bad this product is. <laughs> so what I would do is I would add a section. I'm going to go to five sections. And that doesn't change any data. It just adds a heading here with default names. Then I have to turn editing on. And I'm going to modify this one's name from topic four to, for example, non-programming assignments. So I'll edit the name. I have to say, don't use the default. Non-programming. Oops. And this is purely layout of the front page. It has no effect on grading or anything. I'm going to modify this one to be, for example, um, final project deliverables. Okay, so that's the one, the stage one. Stage, this is just layout of the front page. Stage two, again, you probably won't have to change it because I can, this is easy to set up forever, is we go to greater report and we go to setup and we see that there is this is the course name. Here is the category of grade called participation only, and that's 10%. So I'm going to put 10 in here, and that's the weight. That's all I have so far. So I save it. Now I'm going to add a category. I'm going to add the category of, for example, uh, programming assignments. I'm going to add category programming assignments. And I happen to know after a lot of research that that's the one I want. <laughs> so, <laughs> and, and so on. And I'll take care of this. So you don't have to do this. Oh, but it's, I, it's, I guess I didn't do it right because I need to have a box like that. So I have to edit it and see what did I do wrong. I thought it was, yeah, uh, simple. No, it's weighted unit grades. Or is it, uh, no, it's. Not this one, is it? Uh, actually, I was wrong when I was boasting that I knew. <laughs> it should have a number here if I got the right type. So let's see what type I have here. Oh, it doesn't have a number there. No, but that's for up, up on top. So, uh, great, but no, that's not it. Um, what am I looking for here? Great type. Uh, uh, interesting. Uh, go back here. Now, what did you say? You had, I had a number. I have a number here. Oh, you don't have a number. I don't have a number. Oh, you're right. Oh, oh, you're right. So it's, I put it on the wrong level. Thank you. Okay. Very good point. So really what's going on, I told you this is confusing. <laughs> uh, so really what I want to do, this is just regular simple, simple mean of grades. Okay. Because really what I need is at the top level. This is where I put... Uh, uh, this one, and now they all get the little box. If I do this correctly, let's see. Yeah, so this one is now, as I said, this is 10, and this is I'll change this anyway, but this is just to illustrate. So now we've created the category save changes. Now, so let's say you see I send you an email saying, Please add that one. Okay, so you go look at it, and you say, Aha, uh, there's a deliverable here, it's Lecture four, number one. So what you do is you go to the front page, which you find most easily by just going to this. And it's going to be a class participation assignment. Um, I would say this. I don't put, I have to put it in here, participation only, and that's where you would know. You would add an activity. And because it's 
a warm-up, my email will also include to you the questions. And there'll be always three questions. So uh, here's what I would say, because I, I will have asked them to read chapter one and four. So what I do is I go through chapter one and four, and I find some really simple questions. So I'm going to go, uh, I'm, it's going to be a quiz, okay? And it's going to be called 4.1 uh, warm-ups for chapter one and four. Don't need that. The timing is going to be January 21. Oh, let's enable that. Uh, it can be open anytime, it doesn't matter. But it has to be handed in by January 21. Uh, at the classes at five, so that day, so at eight o'clock, or let's say nine o'clock, 9 a.m. Okay, in addition, so that's one setting. Wednesday you said at noon. I said at noon, thank you for reminding me. Okay, good, 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 at noon. Uh, and there's no grace period. These just, if you don't have it in, you don't have it in, you're dead. Now you go to grade, grade category. Now it appears here, participation only, because of the other setup we did. Okay, layout, I think we don't do anything. Oh yeah, we do um, new page, all questions on one page. Question behavior, I don't think we touch. We don't touch any of this stuff. Uh, and then you say save and display. Now there's no questions yet. So now you go to edit quiz. And you add, so th the total is going to be 100 always. And, oh no, I was going to do it differently. Ah, shit. Uh, forget everything. No, don't forget. It's useful to know, but I'm not going to use a quiz for this. I'm going to use something new. I just remembered. Okay, but just okay. You'll see how you get, out, get yourself out of this. So this is incorrect. So I'm going to edit, delete it. Okay, that's the one I just added. Yes. And I'm going to start do another one. It's going to be a feedback. It's a new one. And same idea. It's going to be no, don't put that in there. It's going to be 4.1 warm-ups for chapter one. Same idea. Availability, uh, allow, allow answers until um, January 21 at noon. Save and, save and display. Oops. Uh, please. Okay, here's the warm up. And I'll give you this text in my email. Please. Okay. Um, uh, now I'm going to say that. Question one. Um, what is model. I'll, I'll change these because I'm not sure what they are. I'm doing this from memory. Q2. Um, what is the difference between Ruby and Rails? This should be easy, you know, and Rails. And then the third one is, the most important one is, say two or three things that you are still confused about, or if everything is clear, say one or two new things you learn. Okay? And, uh, okay, so now we're gonna, we, oh, I thought I just did this. Uh, no, until then, yep. Yes, 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 yes. Save. Okay, so I can even give a completion message if I want. Do you have your computer with you? Yeah. Why, why don't you log on and, and try this and see what happens? You know, I'll show you the latte for. 
well, but I did it also as an experiment. So here, uh, just quickly, this is what it looks like. I did this in the, in the 12D course, and I asked, what is the topic that still confuses you? And boom. So I could just look at this and go like, ah, I see, okay, I'll talk some more. Everybody's confused about arrays. So that's the, that's the idea for this too also. Okay, so, oh, you, because you're, um, oh, to a, to, a, to, a, to a student, but now it's closed, so you should, probably should, wouldn't be able to see it. Yeah, answer the questions, go ahead, yeah. My cat also has a doctor appointment. Hey, you're here. That's weird. <laughs> Why the nothing showing up? <laughs> Let's see here. Oh, maybe that was just the introduction. The questions is another thing. Ah, okay, see, I made a mistake. So go back here, edit this, edit, 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 edit settings. Uh, these. Thanks. Ah, uh, questions. So that was a mistake I made. Save and display. And now I have to say, edit questions. I'm going to have one question, and it's going to be a longer text answer. And it's going to be this. Oh, interesting that the, the space for the question is not that large. Let's just see here. Go back. Uh, hmm. Hmm. So yeah, that's, I'm glad we're doing this together. So, or maybe information. Let's see. Nope, that's not very useful either. Let's go back. I'm gonna put go back to a longer text answer and just see what happens if I paste this whole thing in here. Okay. That's fine. No dependence on the same question. Okay. Uh, it's not so clear, is it? It's a little jammed together. Yeah, I can. Uh, the problem is that it's a little bit more difficult to review, but I think that's exactly what we have to do. So go back, edit questions. I'm going to, where are the questions? Edit questions. I guess I didn't save it. save it, that's why. Okay, edit, I see here, edit. Question one, what is the model? And uh, don't need five lines. I actually wanna change the type now to be something else. So, because it's less text, the easier it is on us. Edit questions again, three page, it's okay. I'm gonna go instead to, oh, here. Delete this one. Yes. I'm going to add a short text answer. Question one. What is active model? I don't need that. And no, five is too little. <laughs> I would say 20. No dependence, that's position one. Okay, I don't know what that, oh, that must be the label. Okay, that's no problem. Let's try a longer text answer, see if that's better. Yeah, that's probably better to use. So now it's, that's 
one. Great points. You can play with that, whatever makes the most sense. Uh, with lines five. That's probably too much. Okay, no dependence item save. That's a little better. And question number three. Longer text answer. Maybe the two short ones can be short and the one that's a little bit more is a bit, be a little bit more, if you know what I mean. <laughs> uh, Okay, same question. Okay, good. So now, um, I think I'm done. So let's see what it looks like for you now. Mm -hmm. What is active models, you know? <laughs> They're allowed to look it up in the book, so it's, uh, it's purely to make sure they. But I'm not. I mean, I made it up. I don't remember anymore if it's actually in that chapter. So let's uh, actually check. Where is my book? Is it back home? Did you just need to steal it. Uh, it's agile web design. It's pretty fat, so it should show up there. Pretty obvious. Okay, well, I'll have it at home then. I'll, I'll, I'll send you the official email so you can put it in. But that's the idea. Now, let's keep on working on this. So, so now we have to do uh, edit settings. So, uh, availability, we set a date. It's available now, but answers until that time. This says, yes, record their name. Yes, after submission. Thank you. Uh, now, the interesting question is going to be the grading with this model, because it's not asking me for a grade. So, let me go back here. So, now we have it here, right? So, now my question is, if I go... Feedback. That's a little speaker. Um, I don't think feedback can be graded. Are you, do you know it from before, from another course, or just intuitively? <laughs> yeah, yeah, because I just want to give everybody a hundred if they put it in. It's, that's the grade. But the question is, we have to get it into the grading, uh, grade grading page. Otherwise, we get problems. So let's just see if it shows up. Um, grade star candidates. Nope, does not. Oh yeah, no, it doesn't. Shit. All right. Well. <sighs> Has to be a, has to get, but that's such a pain. Oh. Think about it. Okay, we could just ask them to submit a PDF instead of using a quiz, and they, that's probably the best thing. Okay, that's okay. We're we're learning together. That's why you see, I told you we had to sit together for a while. So let's go back and oops, no, don't use that to go back. So I'm going to delete this one again, or at least hide it. We might want it for later, just for fun. This is very useful actually. So it's just a simple assignment. Form up for uh, uh, it's going to be fifteen point one whatever it was. What was it? Not there. Oh, sorry, four dot one. Four chapter one four four. I love it. Please answer. Uh, please be very brief. <laughs> we can experiment now. That you, I think you you get what I'm trying to do here, right? We allow right now. Due date is again twenty one. Same idea. Uh, Twelve. Same idea. I'm glad we're doing this. Submission types. So here you can actually decide to allow only online text. No word limit. Um, 
How we give feedback is important. So what you want to do is enable feedback comments and enable offline grading worksheet. Do not enable this. Submission settings. No, don't worry about that. Turn it in. You turn it on. Turn on, turn it in, which will check for uh, cheating, although nobody will cheat on this. And then you go to grading, grade, and you say the scale is just a regular point scale. Don't worry about that. And you go here and you say participation only. And you save and return to course. It's very easy. Okay, now, uh, interestingly, um, it ends up here, which is not where we, oh no, it is the right place. I'm sorry, I take it back. So if you turn off uh, editing, you can see sort of more what it looks like. So the, okay, so there it is. So now try it, see what, whether it shows up. No, you gotta be a student. Are you still a student? Oh yeah, okay, that's, yeah. Um, can't you just type it here? Oh, you got a lot. Oh, I see. Gotcha. Okay, great. So now you just answer the question. And, uh, right? And then when you come, so then when it comes time to grade this particular kind, I actually submitted it, right? So now when you go to, what you do is when you go to, you go to this thing again, at grading time, and uh, you see this, and you can, you can, uh, see, choose. It's funny, the thing doesn't, oh yeah, I, I gotta look for you in here, somewhere it's gonna appear. Well, yeah. Maybe you won't be here, <laughs> right. I think it, the answer will appear right here. Yeah, you don't seem to be here unless, no, because it's, there's nobody else, right? No. Okay, so ba but basically, um, what I always do, in fact, is I do this, download, download grading worksheet, and that, choo, here, you open it in Excel, and it's much easier. I put the grade in here, 100. I can read here what they wrote, online text, I can give comments here, good point, if you need to, and it's very fast. You do them all, you save it, it gives you this error message, you say don't worry about it, <laughs> and then you go back here, uh, don't save again, I won't do it in reality, but now you go back to this thing, and you do upload grading worksheet, and it just psh, does them all, and that's the fastest way to do it. And remembering that for the warm-ups, uh, all you got to do is give everybody 100 to put anything in. So that's really fast. Okay, let's take another example. Now I think we've got, I think, I think, um, I think uh, it's going to be similar. So let's take another example. Let's take, uh, just for the fun of it, find one that's not, right, here's one. So if I, if I asked, I did this one already, but um, I would, this one, well, let's go to a later one that I haven't done yet, even though I'm changing the homeworks a little bit, but uh, here's the team deliverable, okay? So what I would do is I would go, okay, Peter just told me to please put in team deliverable. So I'm going to go to the home page again. I'm going to go, it's a team deliverable. I guess I got to turn editing on. Is that team feature on the page? No, no, it's just a name. So just a, just a, oh, there is, no, there is a team feature. Once we know the teams, we can declare them in Latte. And then you can tell there's one member of the team to submit them and everybody gets it. Once we have teams. Okay, so then you add an activity. It's, a, it's very similar to what we just did. And what I always do is I, give the, I do this thing here. I go uh, 6.1 because it's the first one. And I copy the title. You know, uh, project kickoff post. And then I just do this. I will, b before I send you the email, I will have checked this text to make sure it's correct. You just do this, click it here. I usually, to be a little neat, remove that. <laughs> That's just me. Uh, and then I go here and I go the same thing. I go 
27. This is a regular homework, so it's uh, January 27th at class time, so it's 5 p.m., 17th. Pardon? 27, yeah, okay, yep, you're right. Uh, submission types. This time you only allow file submissions, no online text, because we want all PDFs. Feedback types, you allow feedback comments, so you put them in the spreadsheet, and offline grading spreadsheet. Uh, you go to turn it in, turn that on. You go to grade. Now this is a team one, so instead of uncategorized, you put, I didn't put it yet, but I would put team here. Okay, and uh, that's basically what I have to do. Save and it's all set. Let me show you how, let me just fix that so you, I keep on indoctrinating you with, uh, with latte. So to fix that problem, I just discovered there was no category, right? I go to grades, uh, I go to setup, I create a new category. I'm gonna call it team deliverables. Uh, so really all I have to do. But then I have to make sure it ends up in the right level. Yes, it does. I'm gonna give it the right weight. So I go over here. And team deliverables are 50, no, 35, no, wait. Uh, team contribute, no, it's team, it's what we're talking about, team final. Uh, hmm, interesting, I have to tweak this, but let, this is not, this is, uh, it, it would go into here, I think. I, I'll, I'll play with this a little bit, but let's call it, um, think about this for a second. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it's the final part, it's part of the final project deliverables. Yes, I'm just going to rename, I'm going to rename it. So this is 35, and I'm going to call it final project deliverables, not team deliverables. Because unlike 165, where I have a pilot project and a full project, this is only one project. So this is going to be part of the final project deliverables. OK, so now I have the right weight. Oh, no, I don't have it yet. I'm going to have the right weight, 35%. Save changes. And now I'm going to go back to the one I just added, and uh, this one here, and I'm going to edit it, and I'm going to say, all I have to do is change its grading category. It's not a programming assignment, it's a final project deliverables. Make sense? Does all the deliverables weight the same? All the deliverables within one category weights the same, except then at the very end, I'll go through and tweak them a little bit. The more important one, the less important ones. But generally, yes, they weight they, they weight the same. So basically, everything will be. Assignment. Yes, everything's going to be an assignment. Now, because of what we just did, yes, everything's going to be an assignment. As we play with this, we'll have another discussion in a few weeks and see how's it going. We could change it, you know? Last semester, I used for the, for the warm-ups, I used the quiz. The problem with that is that you have to go through each one and say 100, 100, 100, which is a pain because you can't do the spreadsheet. So now we're going to get them as PDFs. Oh, the thing I didn't show you is that you can also do this to speed things up. Uh, no, but we can decide. Um, go back to this thing, this one. We, uh, we said that they have to be submitted in line, so they would end up here, uh, text, online text. And if we decide that's not as convenient, oh no, you can, there's, if you say, uh, if there's attachments, then you can actually, um, if, if they're PDFs in other words, then you can download all of them and you get a directory full of PDFs. And they're a little bit faster to review. So we'll play with that, but for now let's leave it online text. Okay, questions? Okay. Uh, I'm gonna, now that we're talking, I'm gonna go through this and, and really make sure it's correct. Um, and then what's gonna happen is, I'm gonna send you an email saying, hey, please take a look at lecture three, uh, homework one and two, can you put them into latte for me? Okay? Normally that would be, well, two days before class? 
at the latest. I mean, that, it's, you know, my objective, as I think you heard, heard me say this, my objective is that it's a week before class. But sometimes things change, things move fast, and I end up messing it up, and so sometimes it changes earlier. But generally, it's, I definitely, my goal, which I don't meet perfectly, is that the homeworks are stable a week before the day of the class. And that's what I really try to do. Okay? And then you and, and uh, Prakat's role is going to be then a week after or five days after, b before five days after to go through to the grade. Some of them, like the, the work, the, the uh, warm ups are super easy to grade, just go from 100. Other ones, you may have to, you know, maybe it's obvious, maybe you're not sure. Like, let me give you an, another example, for example. I'm going to do more this time than uh, uh, that are going to be, uh, um, that are going to be, uh, participation only. I think that a lot of them, that's a, that's a new concept and I like it very much. <laughs> so, for example, if I went to um, this one. Uh, this one this one is going to be graded, but it's going to be graded very vaguely. It's going to be kind of like uh, 40 points if you didn't submit it, 80 points if you submitted something, oh no, 70 points if you submitted something, 80 points if you submitted something looks pretty decent, 90 points if it's fantastic, and almost nobody gets 100. <laughs> I mean, occasionally something it's going to be so magical that you get 100. But generally, you know, my, my rule of thumb, if something is really well done, that's an A-. minus. And if it's something that's, uh, to get a full A, it's got to be something that blows my brains out. That's how good it is. But, I, but for each one, I will give you, I will give you sort of a hint. Just here's how to look at it. Some of them are going to take more judgment. These, this kind is very quick. We're less interested in the grade and more interested in reading what they said. And the, and, and, and the, and the purpose of the idea basically is that uh, you and Prakat tackle the grading and then when you look at it, go like, wait a minute, we don't know what to do with this. Then, then we, you say, Pito, like we looked at it, but we definitely need a discussion about the, the, the rubric and then we'll do that. And what about portfolio review? Portfolio review are changed. Okay, portfolio review is going to be, uh, we haven't talked about that. It. It's a good reminder. It's not going to be graded anymore because that seems not very useful. Uh, really what I'm going to ask you and Prakat to do is to look at them once a week. And, do, and what you're looking for is, well, let's see if anybody's really done anything yet. What you're looking for is, uh, you know, oh, there's the one with the numbers. <laughs> okay, so this person here, hard way. Nothing. He or she just created the directories. Nothing yet. Which is okay. You know, we're, so he doesn't understand the idea. Okay, so he's, he or she, whatever it is, whoever it is. Okay, cool. So this one is doing stuff. Okay, nice. Now you, you can't see anybody actually started the movies yet. So you just, what I want you to divide the class in two and spend 15 minutes going through them and saying, okay, progress, progress, progress. Whoops, this person hasn't done anything yet. Looks like they're two weeks behind. Send them an email saying, hey, what's going on? No grading. It's just uh, as if you were, they were sitting in a room and you're walking, looking over their shoulder. But, it, but I need you guys to be on it, to say, okay, you know, it's, it's beginning of the week, Prakat and, and she sit together for an hour at a special time, and you just go through the thing quick. And then you say, everything okay, everything okay, done. And notice if anyone's behind. Yeah, if anybody's behind, if they're doing it totally wrong, you know, if they totally misunderstood the assignment, something like that. So like the one I just saw here, I could I could see immediately, you know, they're doing it the right way. It's whoever that was. Yeah, this, this is the right way. They, they, yeah, I don't really care what's in it. They're doing it. If, you know, by, for example, by, by next Wednesday, people should have done up to lesson 40 in the hard way. There better be stuff in that directory. If there isn't, it's like, hello, what's going on? You know, that kind of thing. Good. Any other questions? No. Okay. Um, I will save this file and I will, uh, can I email it to you? <laughs> I don't know how I'll get it to you, but um, screen flow, stop. Stop record.